Good day guys, MF West here and this is a short video guys showing you some possibly massive changes um, on the PTR for and holy. Now as you know a lot of classes are being data mined, um, they're showing how classes are changing for Battle for Azeroth and DKs haven't really been mentioned at all. Um, everyone thought maybe maybe some of the specs or all the DK specs aren't being changed. It may be the case, they might be actually keeping DKs as they are but they have finally actually gotten to Death Knights and they've actually added a small thing today on the PTR. Now this, these are PTR, it's not official, it's just beta testing so a lot can change but why I think this might go through is uh, one of the abilities that we're getting, Death's Advance, praise the lord, uh, it was added like um, months ago onto the PTR so it's been on the PTR for a long time but They've somewhat made it official on Wowhead, so that's great. But let's talk about the two abilities that they've added for Death Knights. So, first one is called Thought Seize. Um, it says, steals a beneficial magic effect from the target. This effect lasts a maximum of two minutes, and activating the spell again will transfer the effect to a friendly target. That is awesome. That is really, really awesome. So... Jeez, like in dungeons you could still buff from mobs and give them to, I don't know, your healer or caster in PvP. I don't, it's just going to be great. Kind of, I think that's like the PvE version of Dark Sim. I don't know how it's going to work. Maybe this is replacing Dark Sim and you can use it in PvE. I am not sure. Now the next one is what I am extremely excited about is good old Death's Advance. It might make a comeback. Hopefully this goes through to Battle for Azeroth, but... As it stands, Death's Advance. You get it at 55, it's a standard ability that all Death Knights have. 30 second cooldown, for 10 seconds you cannot be slowed below 100% of normal speed. You resist force movement effects by 80% and you are immu immune to external knockbacks. Passive, you cannot be slowed below 70% of normal speed. That is a lot different to how Death's Advance present or I guess Unholy's presence was back then, but I mean, I'll take it. I am so sick of only having race war, guys. So sick. So I'm going to keep my eye on everything to do with Death Knights, just in general, for BFA. And I'll be posting as soon as I can get my hands on it. So you can trust me to get that information out to you guys. But let me know what you think down below in the comments. Do you think they should, what do you think should be happening to Death Knights? Even talk about all the specs guys, or Unholy specifically, but this is a step in the right direction. Fixing Unholy's whole Juggernaut class fantasy thing. I mean, this does make us more of a Juggernaut, like we're unstoppable. We just walk towards our targets and, you know, blow diseases and whatnot. But let me know what you guys think. Stay Unholy guys, and have a good day. MF West out. Peace.